Hey there, YouTubers, time for another video. This one is gonna be a little bit different and hopefully I think I may have got an idea that could be helpful to some people. I've been trying to think of something that might give a little bit more added benefit to people. And I've come up with an idea that I'm gonna try to do as like a recurring series, maybe even possibly even weekly of things that would be helpful to other people that want to do the van life or might already be doing the van life. And some of this stuff will apply to RVs as well. So this series is going to be um, van tips, tricks, hacks, and gadgets. Because <laughs> I got to have an, a gadget in there because I'm a big gadget fan. So I think over the years I've been doing van stuff, I've, I've had some good ideas of my own that I think would help other people and I've seen other things around that again might help other people. I'm going to try to keep this quick. I don't want it to go too long. Um, well, if I end up doing these weekly or recurring, I'm going to try to also keep those quick, maybe one or two items. Today we're going to start with one item that's I think is a pretty cool tip or hack. I don't know which one you might consider Some it. of you, if you've been watching for a while, you may have noticed this. You may have heard me speak about it. You might not have. So let's go check that out. It's over this way. We're going to go this way. All right. So this is my first tip or hack or whatever it would be. This is a sweatshirt. I think the best sweatshirt to use, or it's actually a hoodie, would be a Yankees one because, you know, the Yankees are awesome. But if you don't like them, you can use any other one you want except Red Sox. I, I don't think those will work. I don't think they're viable. So there's two things about this. I actually have two hoodies on there, if you can see down the red one. And down at the very bottom, I have a burlap bag that I've put over the seat. It's real tight, but it fits. The reason why I have the burlap bag on there is if you see this wonderful piece of duct tape, that's because I have a cat that sometimes needs to stretch and claw. And he kind of has, has clawed these up with his nails a little bit. So I put the... Uh, burlap bag on there to try to protect the seats. So there are a few benefits to doing this. One is the door getting in and out is pretty small and you'll find yourself a lot of times grabbing the top of the seat to get in and out. Well this is going to protect the top of the seat from where whether you want to keep your van forever or you want to sell it. I take the arms, kind of the cool part about the hack. It's a great place to store stuff, we'll get into that. But I just take the arms, I put it over the top, then I take the arms fold them in on themselves and the other be added benefit is there's storage right there while you're driving so like I often keep my cell phone in there so I can grab it while I'm driving um, all kinds of stuff in there that you can get to quickly and keep some good storage um, on the other side same thing I tend to keep these lighters for my propane grill I keep them right in there so that when I'm going in and out to use my grill, it's right there. You can keep a lot of things. In the pouch down here, I can also keep some things. Sometimes I keep uh, screens that go in the window or little things in there or tools. The same with the second one that's in there. Like, here's those window screens I was talking about. I'm able to just fold them up and put them in there. And then I know where they're at and I can get to them relatively quick and they're not in the way. So if you want to borrow that, steal that, whatever you call it, I think if you have a van, that's a great way of protecting your seats. And one little thing to go with it, over here is just a nasty green sweatshirt that I use that I put over my driver's seat when I'm not driving, this thing. And I do that for pretty much the same reason, but it's mostly just to protect the seats when I'm not driving from being covered in cat hair. I slip that over the top and then when I get ready to drive I take it off and my clothes will not also be covered in cat hair when I reach whatever my destination is. So there's a quick little hack or tip or whatever you want to call it. Hopefully it's something that you might find useful for yourself and there'll be more things to come. Until then, have a great and wonderful day.